display of affection is not a Crane family tradition. Control is. But one day you will be head of the Crane family. And together we can remake the Cranes. We can make them a real family. A happy, loving family. I've never heard you talk like that, Mother. Aren't you happy now? <laughs> what a silly question. Of course I am. I'm Mrs. Julian Crane. I have everything any woman could ever ask for. Do you have love? Oh, really, Ethan? No, Mother, do you have love? Oh, Mrs. Crane, I'm sorry. I didn't know you were in here. I was walking by Ethan's room, and I couldn't help myself. Where have all the years gone, Pilar? I mean, he was a little boy, and now he's a grown-up man. Children grow up so fast. Too fast, if you ask me. <laughs> I can hardly believe mine are almost all out on their own now. Which reminds me, I, uh, I met your son Luis last night. Oh, I, I didn't know. He came to the house rather late. He was investigating some gunshots he thought he heard coming from Julian's room. Oh, my goodness. Is Mr. Crane all right? Yes. But Suzanne doesn't work here anymore. I see. As you might gather, my evening with my husband didn't turn out quite the way you'd hoped. I'm sorry. I'm not. Tell me, Pilar, does your son Luis have some sort of grudge against my family? Oh, if he was out of line, Mrs. Crane, I apologize. It's, it's just that he hates to see me go off to work every day. I tell him I don't mind, but... That's okay. I, I understand. You're lucky your children love you so much. Oh, yours love you too, Mrs. Crane. Yeah, I know they do. I just wish I had more time to spend with Ethan now that he's home for good. I know that feeling. I'd like to spend more time with my children too, especially Teresa. <laughs> She's such a dreamer. I do worry about her. <laughs> Dreaming's not so bad, Pilar. I imagine she's lovely. I can show you her picture. Oh. What a beautiful girl. You must be very proud of her, Pilar. I am, Mrs. Crane. Teresa's very special. But I do worry about her. My son Luis found her a summer job, and I'm not quite sure how it's going to work out. And, well, my Teresa isn't the kind of girl who should have too much time on her hands. <laughs> well, she's at that age. You know, Pilar, I have an idea. I said I wanted to spend more time with my children. Yes, Mrs. Crane? Well, one way to do that is to hire a personal secretary, somebody to help me with the uh, day-to-day schedule. You know, appointments, thank you notes, shopping, that kind of thing. Uh, I'm not sure I understand. Well, I was going to advertise for someone next week, but why not help you and your family out at the same time? Would Teresa like the job? Oh, Mrs. Crane, oh, I... She'd be well paid, and the work wouldn't be that difficult. And you could even keep an eye on her because she'd be in the house. Well, I don't know what to say. I... Say yes, Pilar, and tell Teresa to come by and see me about the position. <sighs> Teresa, work in the Crane Mansion, near Ethan. Oh, no.